What's up legends? Today we're going to be running one of Mox HD's favorite loadout, which he calls the infinite build. So shout out to Mox HD. He was actually the first creator I've ever watched any Helldivers video on, and that was even before Helldivers 2 was even released. I'll link his YouTube channel and his YouTube video in the description box below, so check the brother out. So the loadout goes a little bit like this. You go with the laser cannon as well as the guard dog rover. This is going to be a laser heavy uh, build and we're also going to be bringing in the rail cannon strike he prefers the rail cannon strike over the orbital laser and uh, yeah we're going with that we're not changing anything at least not yet anyways we also bring in the expendable anti-tank which he likes to use it to deal with chargers and bio titans and such uh, as most of his video does seem to be focused mostly on Terminid. But yeah, since our major order is against the bots, we will be running this build against the bots. Uh, we bring the stamina uh, enhancement. I don't think he mentions that in his video. We also bring in the scythe as the primary weapon, the dagger seven as the secondary weapon. And for the grenade, he uses the impact incendiary grenade. But I do believe that he chooses that for the Terminids, not necessarily the bots. So we change that onto the stun so that we can have an easier time against the hulks as you will see in the gameplay uh here in a second for the armor set we bring in the butcher which i believe to be the best heavy armor set to use against the automaton the following gameplay may have literally been the hardest game i have ever played against automatons and somehow still managed to win and extract spoiler alert but boy i i, I do believe that it was the hardest mission i've ever played it was intense. Honestly, I don't know what the hell happened this game. It just kept throwing factory striders at us, hulks, devastators, the whole deal. Anyways, let's get straight to it. Dude, I'm not exactly sure when was the last time I used the scythe. I don't think I ever actually used the scythe like to try to make a video with it. I know I just tried it out on my own, but I don't think I ever made a video with the scythe. This should be a first. All in here, the guard dog rover and the laser cannon. Mogs HD did say you could swap out the for his build. He does sometimes swap out the scythe for the sickle for those who prefer it. But I kind of figured we'd stick with the whole laser theme, you know, for the primary, the secondary, the support weapon, as well as the guard dog rover. We see the AAs there, so we're going to be going for that. Going to get rid of that before it becomes an issue. There's certain secondary objectives that you can kind of leave alone but i don't know i don't like risking leaving an aa alone imagine if we try to extract later on in this game and we have to use stratagems and this guy is not gonna let us yeah so the laser cannon can just shoot right in front of the front plate of the turret it's not really an issue although it does take a while Honestly, I'm actually feeling quite confident about this build. The scythe has no recoil, does it? It's dead accurate. Just can't see its head though, because it's so tiny. There we go. Okay, yeah, no, th this might work. This might work. It's so accurate. I like it. By the way, in case you guys didn't know, the scythe is one of the lowest DPS. Oh! One of the lowest DPSs in the entire game. It's like the second lowest or something like that. Okay, so this is why I chose stun grenades. Oh. Bam! Bam! Beautiful. Oh. We're already pretty low on stems. We're going to need to resupply here. Oh, yeah. We're definitely going to need to resupply. As always, shooter devastators are going to be annoying to deal with. I'm just going to have to beam those little eyes. So with proper cover. Ow. Holy crap, didn't even realize my health was so low. Almost died there. Yeah, so the guard dog rover is almost definitely a bad choice here. I don't think the guard dog rover is going to be doing us 
much of a favor. I mean, it's to keep the, the laser theme. But yeah, the Guard Dog Rover against the bots? Yeah, probably not a good idea. I'm sure it's going to be great against the, the bugs. It's good for dealing with hunters and such. MoxHD did also say that he uses this build strictly in group play, so... Um, might not necessarily apply for solo play, but we're gonna run it anyways, you know how we do. Right, we got another big boy. Jesus. Holy crap, dude, we literally got enemies from every th three different directions already. This is the issue with heavy armor. I picked the heavy armor here because since we're using lasers, we kind of need to stand still, right? As we beam down our enemies. Oh, shit. So I just kind of figured the heavy armor would be a better. Ch oh, crap. Is that a gunship? so dark I just figured since we have to stand still and beam them with the lasers a heavy armor would be a better idea but this is why you should always run stealth when you're soloing bots boys I'm only not running stealth here for the sake of this video but always run stealth oh god oh my god dude there's so many of them done Type them real quick. Nice. Beautiful. Bit of you. Please don't rocket me. Please don't rocket me. Yes. Dude, I got so many lasers. Yo, I dig it. I dig it. I actually kind of dig it. Oh my god. Like, if you actually want to run this solo, I tweak a few things. But I dig it. I dig the, the laser build, because, especially because it's... Oh my god, two more gunships. Where is this goddamn gunship fabricator? Come on, there one. Oh, I need to, to uh, resupply here. There we go, beautiful. Laser cannon is amazing against gunships, I love it. Crap, 15 seconds on the resupply. Shit. Dude, we just keep running into trouble. A few tweaks I'd make is, first of all, the Guard Dog Rover is a no-go. I'd switch it out against bots. If you want to do this solo against bots, switch out the Rover. If you want a Guard Dog, use the regular one for bots anyways. But I would just get rid of the Rover, put in an Eagle Airstrike. Especially because if I face a Factory Strider here, I'm not exactly sure how I'll be able to deal with them. The rest, the rest is okay. Yeah, if you use Rail Cannon Strike and then get rid of the Guard Dog Rover and put in an Ego Airstrike, I feel like you'll have a lot of firepower. I'd also recommend using a Stealth Build. Oh, what the hell was that? Did we get headshotted? I've been seeing a lot of people complain about that. You can actually get headshotted by your enemies, which will cause... Stuff like that. I think that just happened there. Instantly died there. Headshot me, I'll headshot you, bitch. Jeez, dude. Literally got enemies on every side. Beautiful. There we go. Create space here. We gotta push for the gunships. Oh no. Go, go, go. Gotta get to pushing. They're gonna spawn here any second now. We're getting in range. Is that a radar station? No. Gunships. I don't think they see me. Yeah, they don't see me. Just gonna run. 
until we can't anymore. And they're turning around. Here we go. I like to dive and prone. Oh shit, that landed on me? When I'm fighting gunships, I, I generally like to do the dive and stay in prone to get rid of them because, you know, as you guys know, your recoil is much better when you're prone. Pretty much regardless whether I'm using auto cannon, get rid of these mines. Auto cannon, AMR, even laser cannon. Yeah, it's pretty good. By the way, a crazy buff that the laser cannon could receive is the recoil of it be removed. A lot of people talk about how that doesn't make sense, how the laser cannon has like recoil to it. Imagine if it had no recoil, like it would be the automaton killer, dude. I mean, it already is really good. Please work. I've had a few hell bombs in that place that sometimes didn't actually. Okay, it worked. It worked. Beautiful. What? How the hell did it spawn a gunship? Is there another gunship or was it? Jesus, man. Handle that. Come on. Up behind the mountain. Oh, dude, we already got bots coming at us. This is why I missed the stealth armor, right? It feels like when you don't run stealth armor, literally everyone sees you. It's crazy. No way, dude! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's two for two, bro, that they land right on top of me. That's crazy. Bro, these bots can smell me, bro. They're coming from everywhere. Not gonna lie, though, so far, it's pretty solid. God damn it. There we go. Except the guard dog rover, I feel like the little buddy here is not doing any. Well, okay, you killed that little guy, but still, I feel like it's not really doing anything. Because it can't, right? It can't damage anybody except light, like the tiny bots. Because I don't think it aims for the head at all, so it just kind of misses its laser. Oh my god, shoot a devastators. What? I stemmed. Did I not stem? Whatever. All right, let's land on one of them. Actually, that was a terrible idea. Holy crap, I'm in the middle of one. I'm gonna die again. Yes! Correct, idiot. I'm so glad I wasn't punished for my mistakes. Come on, Rover, do something! But I'm not seeing half the things I'm shooting at. The map is so dark. Oh, no, we got a Hulk by the resupply. What? Oh, hell no, we got a factory strider. Rid of you. Hulks are fine, though. Not mad at helps. Here we go. That was nice. See, when you hit your shots like that, come on, climb. When you hit your shots, it's real. Oh my god, wait a second. That's a lot of bots. I can't see that Hulk at all. God, they're like blocking my way there. I don't think I can go through that. Through there. I gotta go the other way. Um, guess I'll try to take the long way around. Since that place is completely blocked off. We're gonna spend like 10 minutes here fighting if we try to push it. I'm gonna... Oh, God. I'm gonna try to run all the way south here and do a whole run around maybe we'll go for the other primary objective first yeah we're gonna go for that one in the middle of the map 
Should be a bit easier. Okay, so far I'm not too, too... It's not too bad. It's not too bad. I could 100% see me using this in group play. You know, the whole point of it as well is that it has infinite ammo, so... It's fantastic for group play. Again, I for bots, I... What is that? Is that the factory strider? What the hell is it shooting at? For the guard dog rover, I would definitely remove it against the bots. Really no reason to keep it. Uh... I'm not exactly sure. I don't quite recall if Mogs <laughs> mentioned any alternatives for the Guard Dog Rover, but yeah, I'd bring in like an Eagle Airstrike over it. Try to avoid that group, dude. We already got in way too many fights. We're 14 minutes deep, boys. 14 minutes deep. All we did was one AA and one gunship. This is looking real bad. Is looking real bad. Is that a radar station? Oh no, that's already the final primary. Alright, let's get here the SSD. Yeah, this is kind of looking grim, isn't it? 25 minutes to do all this. Let's see. See what we can do. I got a quick kill. Ooh, I can't see you. I can't see that bot at all. Have a taste of democracy. Jeez, they're all on to us. Let's start this primary. We're late as hell. I can't really stay around fighting too much. I'm gonna try to hold them off here. Oh god. Oh crap, we got tanks. Is that a double tank? It's a freaking double tank, isn't it? Get rid of one of them. Didn't I call in expendable anti-tank somewhere? What? Was I high? Did I throw that into the sky? What the hell did I do? Did it bounce off the floor? That was a waste. <laughs> Although, ow. Okay. Free supply here, I guess. That is really hard to hit. There you go, Rover. That's the cover I need from you. Now let's just bring this SSD as close as I can to the objective. I'm not gonna sweat about it too much. Because we still need to get all of the other primaries. I think I'll just... Oh my god, yeah, that's too many of them. Leave it here. Oh no, another gunship! Oh, we're so dead here. it out 
Easy. What? Okay. That was the headshot again, wasn't it? With the one hit? Come on. I have heavy armor. How do I get one hit? That's sad. Gotta get rid of this gunship. At least it's the one gunship fabricators. Although it doesn't matter too much if it's only one or two. I don't really have an issue with gunships with laser cannons, but yeah, still good nonetheless. Follow it over here. I know it works from there. What is that stuff in the sky? Let's try to do this uh, generator and we'll be pretty good to go here. After that, we just got to run to the other SSD and chip down. All right, that's one AA. That's a dual. That's two gunships facilities. Oh, um, what the? Does that always happen? You blow him up and one of them spawns when you do that? What the fuck, man? All right, that's frustrating. Sorry for cursing. I mean, I curse a lot, but still. What the hell is that? Joining the fray. Try again. Oh god. Come on. Oh, a factory strider. Oh, oh, that's not good. Oh god. Start up the terminal. Oh, that is so bad. Do we? No, that doesn't hurt it. Okay, so here's what we gotta do. We gotta get rid of the turret on top of it. And then we gotta get rid of the miniguns underneath it. Then we'll laser beam its underside. That's the only way we can fight it off. Holy shit. If we can even fight it off. Holy crap, dude. There's bots everywhere. We got the rail cannon. That's actually perfect. Let's use that on the factory strider to get rid of the... Rid of the cannon. There is the cannon, beautiful. Double miniguns to go. Ow. Fuck, these guys are gonna be trouble. Crap. Here we go. Let's try to find its miniguns. One, two. Oh, Jesus, I need a reset. Oh my god. Dude, we're getting shot from people over there. On the east side, in front of us, to our right and behind us. What the f Okay, we gotta, we gotta go far. We have no reinforcements? Oh my god, this is bad. Oh, we got a tank. Oh, we're dead. We're actually dead. Gotta get my laser cannon back. Our dog rover. Fuck. Oh my god, this metal pipe. What am I even shooting at? Come on, come on, come on. Okay, fuck the guard dog rover. Okay, yeah, you can stay there, dog. Okay, we gotta get rid of you before you shoot me in the back. Do we have an angle here? Strider, Strider. Down. Fuck, that's the Oh my god, I have one health. That's the tank. We got the tank. I wanted to get... Are you seriously coming from that side? Oh my god. We got the factory strider and the tank coming at us. Uh, spend one anti tank. I almost forgot about that, honestly. Up the stims. We got bots again. Oh my god, you guys are... You guys are gonna kill me from behind, aren't you? Try to pop off the tank. How many does it take? I forget. I feel like it's three. Oh god damn it, it is three. How the hell am I gonna get behind this tank? <laughs> I'm so glad I missed. 
Okay, let's get rid of the minigun. One. Two. Okay, factory strider is officially harmless. Get behind the tank. The problem is the devastators the thing can spawn. Oh my god. Come on. Come on, dickhead. Oh my god. Stim. Okay, we got a reinforcement back. This is how I'm gonna have to kill it, but I can't I can't do that. I gotta kill them first. Yeah, I killed them. The factory strider is harmless right now. It's gotta kill the little guys. It's so hard to tell where the beam is going. It's too many crosshairs. There's like three crosshairs. There's the white, there's the dot, there's the green. up yes yes come on reload oh come on stop coming oh is this spawning again oh there we go dickhead let's go holy crap we're still going still going boys Get another shot here. Holy shit. Get some. Get some. Start pushing back. There is so many freaking bots all the time. That's crazy. Is the major order planet usually harder? Like, I don't think that's ever been brought up, confirmed, or anything, but... I don't know if I'm crazy or what, but it does feel like the major order planets are... Freedom never pretty tough, man. I don't know if it's just coincidence or what. Or if it has some sort of, like, oh my god. Sort of like increase rate like look at this dude there's still like a dozen of them we got people shooting from the smoke back there what the fuck are you guys oh we got another group coming I'm getting tortured out here so the one of the things with this loadout is that I just kind of realize is I can't get rid of factories. Oh my god. So I can't get rid of the factory behind me. It's just gonna keep throwing enemies at me and there's just not that much I can do against it. Oh, come on. As soon as I landed my shots on it. What? How are the rockets hitting underneath me? What? How's it launching me up in the air? That's so weird. Oh no, we got another Hulk. Got a whole ass group again. Beautiful. Let's go. Oh, stim, stim. Oh my god, bro. Oh no. Gotta do the terminal. What is he? Is there a tank again? This is so hard. What in 
victory. Gotta reload. Get rid of the strider first. Here we go. Oh my god, it is a tank again. Wait, you're still up? What reinforcement did you call, dude? Please don't be nothing crazy. Okay, some berserkers, no biggie. Oh my god, bro, another factory strider! No! No way! No way! Can we use the expendable anti tanks now? Maybe we can pop the. Maybe we can finally. Oh, look at this army! Whoa. We are so dead! Wait, what do I do, honestly? Oh my god, what the heck do I do? Run away a little bit. Let's see if we can pop this uh, Factory Strider's uh, turret. What I was trying to do on the previous one. Let's see if we can do it on this one. Yo, holy crap, this is, this is insane. Okay. At least that was a clean shot. Just one more. All right, we got the whole whole squad coming. Come on. Okay, I'm dead. That's it. Woo! Beautiful. Turret down. Go 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 go. Not today. If we can go the long way around, give us a bit of a bit of a, of a space here, so we can maybe yeah. Let's resupply. Problem is, I can't call my laser cannon or guard dog rover as we just called it. Oh, we got nine minutes. Yeah, I don't know about that. So we got a generator to do. We still got to run all the way to the other SSD, pick that up, take it all the way to the next primary objective. I don't think... Look at that big boy. Mm. I don't know if we're making it, boys. I'll fight this out anyways. I want to see how... how, how bad this turns out but look at this there's even another group there just big chilling this is honestly one of the craziest games i ever had like i mean in regards of like a game that i'm still out here fighting i mean there there have been harder games that i've just been killed 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 and immediately or not immediately but losing the mission but this one in the sense of like still being able to fight, this has been one of the craziest missions I've had. This is, this is crazy. But I think this is kind of working. I was honestly just trying to avoid that rocket devastator group, but it seems like we might be in the clear for this. Holy shit, can we do this? Oh no. Oh no. What do I do? I think I'll fight it. Really difficult to see the the beam. I don't know why I called for guard dog rover if I already have one. <laughs> Leave me alone. Let me just do the generator. You see that guard dog is doing absolutely nothing. He's just shooting at their hip. Oh my god. Oh, the aim flinch. I hate it. All right. Yo. 
Looking good. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay, I think I'll six minutes. Uh, I think I'll grab this SSD. We'll deliver it to the primary objective, and we'll just sprint to the other one, dude. Maybe like the only way this is still winnable somehow is if I literally sprint from one point to the other and back and and somehow make it oh my god look at another factory strider there <clears throat> of course that one we don't want to mess around with that one is in the heavy factory whatever heavy outpost let's turn this in turn on terminal just to speed things up a tiny bit What the f Is that the factory's trainer? Get off me, bro. Come on, Rover. You have one job. Keep the tiny guys off me. All right. Five minute dude, is this? I don't think it's doable, but we'll we'll, we'll we'll do it. We'll do it. Holy shit. No, oh, that's that's a tower. That's not it's not the factory strider uh in case you guys didn't know you can still win the mission like you know when the when it calls for extraction like forced extraction you still can win the mission even after it forces you to extract so maybe we'll do that i mean i don't think we can do it in four minutes Come on. Just gonna run in there, dude. YOLO. Only way we can win. Not even gonna waste time with you. Done. Go, 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 go. Now, oh my god, there's a tower shooting us. Aren't these towers seeing us from so far away? Please don't shoot me, tower. Oh, that's close. Okay, Strider down. Hide from the tower. Hopefully it'll lose us. It lost us. Beautiful. Let's go, boys. Three minutes. Three minutes. Got a straight run. The final primary objective. That's the only way we can do this. Try to run around all the outposts just to so we don't have to waste any extra time fighting off anybody. Two minutes. Is it doable in two minutes? I'm I'm getting nervous here. <laughs> 
I don't like to upload anything that's not a win, so if I don't win this, you may never see this. Although I might still upload it because holy crap. This is one of the craziest games I've ever had. One that we're still kicking, that is. supply here holy crap boys a minute 25 we can do this as long as there's no big surprise we can do this the problem is when i have to creep up there to that there's a stratagem jammer there good thing it's not a anywhere relevant we would not have been able to do that All right, let's see how hard we have to turn the antenna. Okay. Oh. oh my God. Streamer loot. YouTuber loot. Holy crap. There's no freaking way we just pulled it off. Okay, sir, please don't do that. Please don't kill me. Tiny rock, you already know what to do. You are single-handedly the only reason, the only thing keeping me alive. Oh, the turret lost me. <laughs> I can't believe the tiny rock protected us again. <laughs> oh, let's go, dude. Let's go! Yo, and we did that at zero seconds. At the perfect time. Holy shit, I can't believe that. Wow, that should have been a loss. Alright, now let's just focus on extracting. Okay, we don't want to mess with that group. Uh, let's go around here. We don't need to resupply. I'm not gonna lie, I think... I think this extra minutes on the extraction timer may be actually beneficial for us. See if we can get some samples here before. Oh, we got bot drops. Metals? How many metals we get? Okay. Three metals? Beautiful. Go, go, go. We gotta go the long way around. We gotta avoid as many fights as we possibly can because we literally can't afford anything right now. Let's go around these outposts. Got a minute, boys. Holy minute. crap, dude. Yeah, this tower may be an issue. Maybe an issue. I want to throw... Oh, no, I can't. I was going to say I was going to throw a rail cannon at it, but we can't do that. Uh oh, it's turning. It's turning. Oh, oh, oh okay. Thirty seconds. Let's go, boys. Home free. That was the closest, closest game I've ever had. Like I've had games where I've been stomped harder before, of course, like losing the game. But this was the closest game I've ever been able to somehow still find my way to win it. 
Because holy shit. That was insane, dude. Three factory striders. Like five or six. I think like five tanks, right? No. No, less tanks. It wasn't that many. We killed... I think we killed three tanks. A bunch of hulks. A bunch of devastators. Let's go, boys. Let's go. All right. Holy shit, that was incredibly close. So a quick talk about the build. I think the build is really good. Uh, I think the guard dog rover could be swapped out against the bots. Against the bugs, it's okay because it can handle devastators, warriors, you know, the whole deal. But against bots, it can only handle the little guys. So not worth it at all. An ego airstrike is going to be a much better choice. Or even like an orbital laser, whatever, anything. Really, like literally anything would be better than a guard dog rover. It's very, very weak against bots, sadly. But uh, everything else, even the scythe, dude. I think even the scythe was a good choice because of the lack of recoil. It actually makes it dealing with shoot of devastators like a lot easier. There aren't too many primary weapons that have such perfect recoil, making it easy to deal with shoot of devastators, so... Yeah, I think it was fantastic at that. And we can deal with everything, as you saw there. We can deal with hulks, with factory striders, gunships, uh, tanks, whatever we, we needed. We had, you know, an answer for everything. Anything and everything. How many did we kill? 276? Wow, that felt like... Four shots fired? What counts as a shot? Anyways. Yeah, so we can definitely handle everything with this loadout. So the loadout is pretty good. Thank you guys very much for watching, man. I'll be catching you, Helldivers, on the next one. Let's finish off this major order, shall we? Peace!